What's up guys, it's me, Hunter Ivy, and Happy New Year to you guys. I hope, you're, uh, hope you are having a great year and celebration and all kind of stuff, and hope you have a great day. <laughs> yeah, so what are my updates for this year? So you may be wondering what my updates for this ch for my channel and stuff. Well, let's discuss that, shall we? Well, basically, I uh, have some plans for this year. First off, I am going to plan to do more movie reviews because I haven't done that in a while. And considering the fact I have a set schedule, I'm more about like an organized schedule so I can actually, you know, do more videos. Uh, so, because I got my new job and uh, my other job, I don't work as much, I don't work as, as much, but, um, yeah, it's already been taken care of. The event, uh, been taken care of. Uh, but I'm looking at this other job. And I'm having fun with and everything. And I'm actually looking at the fact that I'm looking at this job better. So yeah. So the other job was a little, you know, difficult to deal with at times. But I don't really mention my jobs uh, that much. But I do mention what what's like for scheduling and stuff. <laughs> yeah, because scheduling for the videos in last year was just difficult to do because. Yeah, I had a lot, of, a lot to do. I mean, with work and everything, it was really tough to get all the, all these things figured out with with work and stuff. I mean, yeah, it was really tough to do. I was really busy last year. I was really busy last year. I barely had anything to do and stuff. Another thing I wanted to mention is I'm not doing any more COVID videos. So last year I said I was going to do one more COVID video, but I'm not going to do any more COVID videos because I just want to have a year where I can just don't think about COVID. I just don't want to think about COVID anymore. I just don't want to think about it because I just want to, you know, relax and just not worry about it. Because when it comes to me, I'm not really worried about COVID. What I am worried about is the people that are acting acting around COVID and stuff. I just want people to like, you know, calm down and just like try to live and relax and just have a good time. Just, you know, have a good time, relax. Just, you know, enjoy your, enjoy your time. Enjoy your time, just enjoy it. Do not try to judge everybody else. Just, you know, enjoy it. Just enjoy it while it lasts. Because remember, you only live once. That's how it goes. So yeah, other things I should mention that I have coming to updates. I am doing more educational videos for reptile events. If you haven't seen my video where I educate some school, educate school and stuff, I appreciate you guys liking that video. Appreciate you watching that video and everything and stuff. And I am going to, you know, put the videos together into like one video soon. I'm still kind of busy at times and, and you know, I have a lot of things, you know, trying to figure out what I can do for my for this year and stuff yeah also I am gonna make a tribute to a person that I do miss dearly soon yeah I'm going to make a tribute to that person I miss dearly yeah I am gonna make another tribute to a person that I do miss dearly yeah it was really tragic to see her die you'll get to see who I'm talking about when I heard the mention about her yeah but anyway um other things I have to mention is I got a new camera. Yeah, I got I got me a camera called Q2 and um, Zoom 4K. It's a, uh, so far I think it's a great camera, but I haven't used it that much. It's my first time using it right now, and hope you guys actually like the quality. I like, hope you guys like the you know microphone, audio and stuff in this camera. I hope you guys actually you know like it for what it is and stuff and probably enjoy it. It's also recorded 4K, by the way. Yeah, I got, I got a set of 4K. Yeah. I'm also doing um, uh, more Rotel videos. Um, Try to, like, you know, plan to, do, to, like, you know, plan to go to, tra like, travel to other places and stuff, just, like, in my state. So probably I'm going to travel to other states to herp and stuff and try to, like, you know, see what the animals are like over there and everything. So let's try to decide to come over here and get my attention. Yeah. 
Also, I'm not going to do any Let's Plays this year because Let's Plays have become pretty boring to me. Because um, for some reason, one of my Let's Plays got uh, got <laughs> a copyright strike, which made no sense to me. I mean, it's it's just a Let's Play of me. It's just a it's just a me playing a video game. That's it. Why, why would anybody copyright strike that? I mean, that makes no sense. And speaking of that, um, I'm hoping I don't get copyright strike when I do more um, audio covers. I do plan to do more audio covers, so, um, excuse me for a second, <laughs> off the table. Yeah, I plan to do more audio covers, I'm hoping to do more audio covers, and hoping I don't get, you know, bombarded by copyright strikes by that, because every time I do an audio cover of a song, I get copyright, I get copyright notice, and I really don't like that because number one that's actually considered fair use so it's no fair for you know a person to get bombarded by you know copyright strike copyright strikes and copyright notices that it's actually using fair use you two should know that they, they should know that they should actually know that stuff yeah I'm also doing more reptile shows and stuff and you know I'm doing more house shows during this year I'm, yeah uh, the reptile show coming up this January, and I'm probably going to do it for one day because I don't have enough time to do it on a Saturday because of work and stuff. But anyway, um, I am going to run a table there on a Sunday, so yeah, I'm, hoping, you know, I'm going to do, do a show there. Yeah, stuff. And hope you get to see me there, but you probably you probably may not know me, but but uh, I'll I'll be there. And it's, it's, it's called Show Me Snakes. That's what the uh, Rotos show is called. And that's what I'm only doing my Rotos shows at uh, is uh, Show Me Snakes because they support USR USA RK, which is actually good. I, I love the fact they actually support USR USA RK, and that's a great thing to hear about. That's a great thing to hear about, indeed. So, yeah, I stopped doing Rupticon because Rupticon has been kind of not supporting USA RK, and they've been just, just doing it for money, and this is not good. I didn't like that. Hearing about that was just not good. So I decided not to become part of Ripticon anymore. I decided to become part of USARK. Well, I am, I am a member of USARK. Uh, well, what I'm trying to say is um, I decided to you know, do shows for Show Me Snakes. Uh, yeah, they, they're, they're much more respectful and better to work with. And uh, I, the show is be bigger and better. And even though last time I didn't make much money, from that show, but at least I had fun. At least I had fun there. I mean, I, I had a lot more fun than I did with the Rupticon. Rupticon was just boring. And, I mean, at least I got paid. <laughs> yeah, but we didn't do much over there. It was, it was really boring and stuff. Yeah, I'm also hoping to educate more, you know, schools and I'm hoping to get more calls from schools and I'm hoping that I get to do more birthday parties. Hopefully, I do get to work to more birthday parties and probably do more videos and stuff of retail events. Yeah, I do plan to do more retail event videos and whenever I get new animals and probably do new herpy adventures and all kinds of stuff. And even try to do interviews with uh, other retail keepers that probably want to do a probably want to have an interview of and everything. There are some people I want to interview in for my videos and everything and stuff. And, yeah, for my videos and stuff. So yeah, I, I would do want to interview people that um, love educating people about reptiles and everything. It'll be really interesting to talk to those people and get to know them more and stuff and, you know, know what they're like. Uh, I mean, it requires a lot of traveling, it requires money for those trips and stuff. So, yeah, that's what I plan to do for retail events to, you know, do some interviews and everything. And speaking of interviews, I do want to do interviews of, pe of people that why they do this and why they do that other stuff. I wanted to interview like other things like you know, I wanna interview like things like the Saint Tag Temple. I wanna interview that. I am planning to visit a uh Saint Tan Temple to see what it's like over there and everything. Yeah yeah, I do wanna interview one of those temples and see how they are. And I've heard there's a a group called Satanic Alabama, and I wanted to see if I can, you know, get in touch with them and see if I can interview, interview them and stuff. But also, um, I, I also plan to do more videos like on a B 
buildings have been abandoned. That's going to be really difficult to do because um, some of these buildings, buildings that I come, acro come across are, you know, really difficult to get permission from, and sometimes I, I have a hard time finding the owner of these abandoned buildings and try to get, you know, photo as many photos I can and videos I can. Yeah, the urban exploring is very hard, and I'm hoping I get more connections with urban with, with, who's actually you know good with urban exploring. If if you know anybody with urban exploring, let me know in the comment section below who I should contact, and um, maybe I can do I, I do some photography with that person. I just want to know who would be best to contact with and best to do some photography with that person and stuff and everything else. To do more, you know, those urban exploring things, because uh, I want to do more urban exploring videos of these abandoned buildings I can go inside of and see what they're like inside or anything. The, you know, the buildings are full of graffiti and has some vandalism on them and everything, and try to you know do some documentary, like many documentaries about them and knowing their history and knowing what they're like in person and everything. It, it'll be interesting to know. Yeah. But urban exploring is really hard it, because uh, you got to get permission from the from the people that, that, that own these buildings. Not only that, um, you sometimes got to be careful because you never know if these buildings are in bad areas. And, and you got to be careful what kind of, what could be in these buildings, so you never know. Yeah, I mean, I, when I was uh, first did my first urban exploring with uh, a building called the Sloss Field Community Center. I had to be careful because um, there was it, was, it was in a really bad area in my part of town. And yeah, it was a very bad, it was a very bad area. I had to be very careful there. And so yeah, that's why it's best to do in the morning and stuff. But I had a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. It was my, per my first time doing an urban exploring. I got permission to do it. Yeah, they gave me permission to eat a combination to get in there and, and get in that building and stuff before they think about, you know, renovating and everything. Uh, I'm glad they let me, you know, go in there and also uh, do photos and just, you know, video and kind of stuff. I mean, I was happy about that. I was really relieved about that. Thank, like, thank you. If you're watching this video, I'm, I appreciate them for that. There are other abandoned buildings I do want to visit that are actually near me, but. It'll be kind of difficult to get permission from them. And yeah, I'm hoping to get more permission from them or probably have to do it the uh, risky way by sneaking in them if, I, if that's my only choice. Yeah, but I don't want to get, I don't want to get in trouble with, with the, uh, you know, the owner and stuff and yeah, and get questioned by cops and everything. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing I don't want to get involved with. But anyway, um, yeah, there's a lot of things I do plan to do. Traveling and do more uh, uh, exploring and even uh, do more herping videos and stuff. Um, educating people about reptiles and stuff and even do more, uh, do more movie reviews and even um, Probably do other videos too. I, 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 I interview people and stuff, and yeah. So yeah, I also plan to do some product reviews. Like, like for example, I just got me a new mini PC. I do plan to, you know, review someday and tell you what my thoughts are on this PC. I mean, I love this PC by the way and stuff. Um, I'm willing to do, do some benchmarks on the PC and everything and stuff. Well, you guys, that's my updates for 2022. I hope you enjoy this update. I hope you find this really good news and stuff. I hope you guys have, have a good new year. I hope you guys are having a great day. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. Bye.